All right, you guys. Here are two girls, one argument, and an innocent guy who got caught in the crossfire. Here is the full story. Do you work here? Sorry? Do you work here? Yeah. If someone leaves their water bottle here and they leave, that means they have the right to the machine still? Uh, yeah, I think so. Oh, look, I'm right and you're wrong. That's gym etiquette. Learn it. Two women, one pull-up machine, and a water bottle. This is how war starts. Um, I literally would have been happy to switch in and out with her, but she was all rude about it. Well, like, yeah, because, like, like, let's say you need to go grab something, like, and you put your put water bottle there, like, saying, like, gym etiquette and don't be able to do Wait, but also, but sometimes, like, maybe it wasn't in sight. Was it in plain sight? It was right here. Oh, okay. Yeah, exactly. You're wrong and I'm Just right. like the WNBA, this gym has all the drama. The guy got caught in the middle of a gym argument like it's a non-skippable uh, GTA cutscene. I don't know. I don't want to be in the middle of this. I don't know what led up to this. At least they're arguing with perfect form and max intensity. Whoa. No, she wants to talk shit. She's called her fetish. She wants to be a bitch and talk shit. That's talk shit, bitch. The gym culture just hit an all-time low, like Nico Cardo Avocado's body weight. Their side eye muscles and vocal cords must be getting a serious pump today. Look, I'm right and you're wrong. That's gym etiquette. Learn it. The spotter here smacked the airports out of this gym, bro. Whoa. If you struggle with one plate and wear pajamas to the gym, you don't need airports anyway. All you need is milk before bed. Grandpa's hydration game is on point with a vintage vodka bottle. Who needs a fancy water bottle anyway, when you can recycle, reduce and reuse to keep both your body and the earth in shape? This exercise is called the hanging bed. His personal trainer told him to hang in there, and he took it a bit too literally. But be careful with those rubber bands, because when you were born by a broken rubber, you don't want to die the same way. This exercise is called the treadmill nose dive. Oh my god, you're right. No. Are you right? It's a new form of extreme exfoliation. It's not an accident, it's part of his facial skincare routine. Who knew a treadmill could be used as a facial scrubber? Are you Are you right? No. Are you right? No, you, no, you're all right. <laughs> Take Kiara. The picture on the wall says, "Keep the spine straight." But this woman is training her spine to failure. Her shoes say Adidas, but her form says, "All day I damage a spine." <laughs> what in the purple pizza planet is going on here? It's hard to judge her form when we don't know which injury she's aiming for. This young gym bro woke up with a headache in the middle of the night and decided to bench 100 kilograms. That's perfect form for 3 a.m. and he's only 14 years old. Now this gym bro has the skibidi wrist. He's doing functional training. Three sets of molesting the gym equipment. When you try to get the machine pregnant, at least buy it dinner first bro. Yeah, buddy! Lightweight! 